Okay, we are going to take a quick look at Prezi and how to make just a really simple one to get you started. So the first thing you'll do is go to Prezi.com, P-R-E-Z-I.com, and create an account, and you'll just need the free account. That's um, You can do everything you need to do with the free account. In fact, I do a lot of things, and I've never had to use any of the advanced features. I can do everything with the free. So that's all you'll need. And then once you get logged in and have your account created, you'll want to click on New Prezi. And it may take a minute just to load um, your Prezi. And if you're in the lab, you'll want to make sure you're using Chrome because, of course, um, the Java hasn't always been updated with Safari. And so use Chrome. And then, so once you've gotten logged in, you've clicked on to create a new Prezi, you'll have all these choices of templates, and there's lots of them. The thing about Prezi to remember is, though, once you have chosen a template, you cannot change it. And so if you find one you really like and you start using it and decide you don't like it anymore, you would have to copy all of your text and paste it in a new one. So um, what I'm going to recommend to you, just because we're getting started, is to choose this blank template, the very first one and click choose and then this is it you'll see over here puts in slides just like PowerPoint as you create them but in Prezi they're called frames and then it's centered in on the middle um, and you've just got one thing on here right now and then so in the middle you'll put in your web 2.0 tool whichever one that you selected to do your presentation on web 2.0 tool and the URL and to add a URL in Prezi, you'll just copy the URL from somewhere else. So go into another site, copy the URL, and then just paste it right into Prezi. When you paste in a URL, Prezi automatically knows it's a link and it hyperlinks it for you. You don't have to do anything else additional for that. Okay? And to navigate around your screen in Prezi, because instead of PowerPoint where everything's on a separate slide, everything in Prezi is on one big page. So we're zoomed in to the center now, but if you mount, hold your mouse over the right-hand side of the screen, you can go to the home, which will zoom back in on the middle, and then you can zoom in and out. I'm going to zoom out just so we, you can get a better idea of what the big picture looks like. So now we've got this um, Web 2.0 tool, whichever one you chose in the center. And then we have to add the four facts that I asked you about the Web 2.0 about it. So we need to add four additional frames. And so you just come right up here to where it says frames and arrows. And we're going to add frames. And we need four more. So I'm going to click add frames four times. And you can choose, you know, what you want it to look like. But if you just choose regular frames, they're going to be these bracket looking frames by default. And that's fine. And it just starts putting them around your center. And you'll see the little numbers by it. This is the order that they're going to appear in. So one, two, three, four. You'll want to rearrange that in an order that makes more sense to you. You may want a straight line. One, two, three, four, five. And I can always zoom out a little more so I can see everything at one time. So, so far, all I've done was it gave me one frame to start with and put it here, and then I added four more frames for my total of five. And then so you'll see each one is here, and these are the order they're going to appear in. And then you can just type what you need to type in each frame. So zoom in on each one and add the information you need to add. You can zoom back out over here on the right, click on the next frame, you can always just move your screen around wherever you want to go um, to add each bit of information in. And then when you're done and you want to see what it looks like, you can click Present. And so this is what it looks like in the beginning. And you can click the forward arrows over. And it moves along to each of your slides that you've created. And that's it. That's how you just set up a very simple Prezi. Now Prezi can do so much more and we'll explore that. Um, you can explore that through the help menu or um, you know, by getting help with your Prezi. But basically that's how you just set it up and add frames. And this navigation is what confuses people the most. How do you zoom in and out? And that's just over here on the right hand side. It disappears 
but when you move your mouse over the right hand side of the screen it will pop back up the only other thing that you'll need to know how to do is inserting images that's right here in the middle you'll insert an image and you can search Google images for the images that you want so if your um, web 2.0 tool, tool for instance is let me think of a good one. Oh, like Wordle. You can search for images that have to do with Wordle and different ones come up and you can insert the one that you like. Or you can insert an image from a file from your computer. And so if you take a screenshot of Wordle or whichever Web 2.0 tool you've chosen, you can um, you know, save that image to your computer and then upload it just like you upload things into eCourseWare. Okay. So I know that was quick, but that's just basically how you get a Prezi set up. Um, and we can discuss it more later.